The engine is starting up. Jets Gary, I'm back making content. I'm glad to be making Jets content again. It's been a while, but I'm back and I'm glad to be back. So the Jets got a problem on their hands. Quinn and Williams on Twitter seems to be unhappy about the way contract extensions are going. He's looking for essentially 23 to 25 million per year, according to Twitter. Shout out to Play Like a Jet on the tweet because Quinn and Williams liked it. It says, Williams is probably targeting the 23 to 25 million. It's hard to find an elite interior pass rusher. There's not a lot of them in the league, and he's a team leader. Pay the man. He liked the tweet, but he took everything off of his Twitter about the Jets in his banner and his profile picture. And his bio says, defensive tackle for blank. So we're going to compare his numbers to recent defensive tackles that have gotten paid and we'll see if he really deserves the money that he's asking for. First interior defensive lineman we will be talking about to compare numbers to is Dexter Lawrence of the New York Giants, who was second team all pro as Quinn and Williams was first team all pro with Chris Jones. Dexter Lawrence had 45 solo tackles, 16 assists, nine sacks, two forced fumbles, and a 92 PFF score. Meanwhile, Quinn and Williams had 30 solo tackles, 16 assists, 13 sacks, two forced fumbles for a PFF score of 90. But take into account that the Jets also rotate defensive linemen, so Quinnen doesn't get as many snaps as Dexter Lawrence. Defensive lineman we will be talking about to compare to Quinnen Williams is Chris Jones, his all-pro partner from this year for first team. Chris Jones had 25 solo tackles, 6 assists, 15 sacks, and 2 forced fumbles with a 92 PFF score compared to Quinnen. Like you said, 30 solo tackles, 16, 13 sacks, 2 forced fumbles, and a 90 PFF score. Two guys I'll be comparing to Quinnen Williams is Jeffrey Simmons and Christian Wilkins. Jeffrey Simmons of the Tennessee Titans and Christian Wilkins of the Miami Dolphins. Jeffrey Simmons had 26 solo tackles, 16 assists, 8 sacks, 1 forced fumble for a PFF score of an 81.1. Meanwhile, Christian Wilkins had a 69 solo tackles, 26 assists, 5 sacks, 1 forced fumble, and an 85 PFF score. Quinnen Williams had a way better season than both of these guys. So now it's time to make the verdict and decision. The conclusion is without a doubt that Quinn and Williams deserves the money he is asking for. He is one of the most elite defensive tackles in the NFL. Top three. He gets the job done. He's a difference maker on the Jets defense. Without a question, you give him the money that he wants. The question is, does he want to be here? That's another issue. I think he does. I think he just wants the money. And I think Joe Douglas will give him the money eventually. Just give it some time. I think it's going to happen, Jets fans. But that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed my first video back. Let me know what you think about the intro. If you haven't subscribed and you're new, subscribe right now. And I'll catch you all later. Peace. Yeah, stop. Wasting my time. Trying to get mine. Get out the way.